high heat and humidity to blame for killing thousands of cows in southwest Kansas over the weekend. The Kansas Livestock Association says the deaths were not centered around one particular area, but rather multiple feed yards. Temperatures reached well into the triple digits, but combined with the high humidity and low wind speeds, it was the perfect storm. Here in western Kansas, we were exceptionally cool in May, and so one of the contributing factors was that some of these animals really haven't had an opportunity to adapt. Heat stress cost the cattle industry $370 million in losses each year. There are many ways farmers can help cattle handle heat, including feeding them in the evening, splitting cattle between multiple pens, and removing obstructions to maximize airflow. The USDA and K-State also put out an animal comfort index forecast. As you can see, the entire state is in severe stress levels, but some places like Sherman County are in extreme danger. So how how much will this loss cost and will it cause you to pay more at the grocery store for beef? Those are questions KSN's Hannah Adamson is looking into. We'll have those answers for you tonight on KSN News at 10.